I'm Rob from Modern Life Survivalist, and today I wanted to talk about the Total EMF Shield. Um, you can order these from their website, or um, you can also get them on Amazon, which is where I got it. Let me just tell you the story. I've been looking for things that had um, EMF protective qualities, you know, that might disrupt the signals, so I was just fascinated by the idea that that was possible you know that ambiently um, you can disrupt these signals and or just affect a change in your uh, reaction to these just by having good frequencies um, like the Schumann resonance come in your direction you know come in your direction and, and affect your cells uh, you know in a positive way so while I still believe that's possible I'm not sure if these devices are really going to do what they say um, this, um, let me get into the details a little bit, the EP does just supposedly generate uh, Schumann resonance, 7.83 hertz. So this is emanating that actually right now even when it's not plugged in because they say it has a mini generator inside of it. Um, if you plug it in though, it creates like a 20,000 foot radius of this signal. Now I, I have felt things from this thing and at first I thought they were positive but if I were to keep this thing um, really close to me for, I don't know, say 20 to 30 minutes, I start to feel like neuropathy in my hands and they get, you know, a little bit tingly. So, um, and you know, if I slept with that there, like if I'm lying on my arm, it'll um, go numb easier. So, I've been um, just experimenting with it for maybe a month or so and I've just decided that it's not a good thing because I put it, you know, far away and got this certain, um, I don't know, relief when it was gone. You know, I noticed that uh, it also, you know, can cause some sweating, uh, just things like that resemble bacteria die off, so I'm not sure if it's actually doing, helping your gut bacteria like I wanted it to. That's been my fascination, is this idea that EMFs can promote growth. And that's what I thought at first when I was getting the neuropathy. I just felt that the bacteria was uh, readjusting and I was getting different, you know, colonies dying off. But I think it does disrupt even some of the good bacteria. That's just a theory. I can't prove any of it, but, um, you know, someday we'll be able to test these things. But, um, you know, I, so I, I left it on this, this Schumann resonance um, most of the time and when I would turn on the both which is the uh, the GW is is the other generator which deals with something um, called um, I think it's geophysical geopathic uh, interference um, this actually supposedly generates a canceling frequency in the same range as um, in the same frequency as, as any interference as it detects. Which I'm not, I don't really understand that, so I didn't even mess with it. And when I did try it, I definitely felt weird and, you know, it just felt like having those frequencies bounce off. But, you know, even right now I'm kind of getting a little bit of a weird, you know, I feel like I'm about to sweat and, and my brain feels a little bit buzzed. You know, and, and when I first got it, I felt good. I thought it was I thought it was working. Three hours where I felt really good about it. So I'm going to try and avoid um, spending much more time with it. Um, I think it, as some people have said it works, but I personally wouldn't recommend it because I just feel like um, I did read some reviews that said it can have an irritating effect on you if, uh, if it's not attenuated to the right um, strength so perhaps that's what's happening is that, yeah it's generating the earth's frequency but there's nothing like or not the earth's frequency but the the stratosphere the frequency between the I guess the ionosphere and the ground you know that is the frequency of lightning 7.83 Hertz I just feel like maybe it needs to be the exact right thing so I um I just felt so much better not having it in the house I had kind of a rough Christmas because I was getting like food allergies and things that you know I thought were just from my diet or whatever but uh, 
I really think it was this thing. Um, and uh, I'll be glad to be rid of it, honestly. Sorry. But I think they're doing the right thing, the company, and they're, you know, trying these things. They're generating um, new products. And um, I hope they continue to shoot for something that can really, you know, overcome the effects of EMFs in your environment, you know, like from cell phones and, and uh, wireless routers, uh, portable phones, um, baby monitors, you know, I think that, um, oh, smart meters too, I think they, they just need to keep going for something that can actually generate this uh, protective sphere for your house, but I'm not. I'm not convinced that this is it yet. <laughs> I was gonna try some other things, but uh, I just haven't, you know, found anything that I was sure about. Um, so yeah, I mean, definitely, I couldn't sleep with it on, and I couldn't. Um, I just don't feel good around it, you know, honestly. So, all right, that's all.